Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to do Scorpio for the rest of the month of August. Let's see what's going to happen with you Scorpions. And this is going to be a general reading as usual. Take it how it resonates. For bookings, you can WhatsApp me or Instagram me. Follow me on Instagram if you want to watch some short horoscopes and messages about motivation, love, etc, etc. Okay? Scorpio. Alright. Someone is watching you clearly. Someone, Scorpio Pisces Cancer looking at you. Oh my God. Someone from the past wants to reconnect. They have strong emotions for you i feel a lot of overwhelming emotions from this person are coming and but this person is not moving forward without you they're coming back okay they're taking a u-turn and they're coming back to you so yeah someone from the past is missing you like anything they're reminiscing the time that you guys once had and they're coming back wow nice reading Actually, they have love for you. They see you as a peaceful person, a spiritual person, and they have fire for you, okay? They see you as a very fiery person as well. This person could be a Pisces, but I feel that they are in a dilemma. They might be, you know, you're dealing with someone who has a good side and a bad side too. So be careful. And I also feel that this person is hiding a lot and they're not letting you know exactly how they feel, okay? They are not revealing too much of their feelings, but they're keeping it to them themselves. Even though, even though if they're going to make a move towards you, they're going to keep most of the feelings to themselves. Okay. They have love for you, okay? So this is what they feel. They have lots of love for you and sometimes to the point of overwhelming emotions, you know. They cannot control their emotions. That is why they find it better to just hide them okay so this person could be scorpio pisces cancer strongly pisces also aries sagittarius leo for some of you yeah they see you as someone they want to be with so the you're like their ultimate wish right now and uh yeah they're coming towards you they're the one they're a kind of a person who doesn't like failure who doesn't like to get defeated so they're gonna stand up again and come back towards you okay so because you're their ultimate wish, they chose you over other options. All right. So this is what is happening in their mind. Strong water energy. Some of you, this person could be an air sign for select few. I feel that you're doing something that is making you more attractive and people are more attracted to you. Maybe you are taking care of your <clears throat> health, looking voluptuous. If you're a woman and if you're a man, you're looking more sexier or more athletic if you're a woman, you might be, you know, embracing yourself, you know, being a natural beauty. And, you know, uh, you, might, you might be exuding a lot of fire energy from your personality. So this is attracting them so much towards you. Some of you might be getting involved into some creativity thing that is attracting this person towards you, Scorpio. All right. I feel that they see you as someone they want to have babies with, kids with, and uh, they'll probably want to marry you, okay? And they'll say that to you very, very soon. Someone wants to hear, someone actually wants to come back to you and express how they feel. Some of you, this person could have their mother wanting them to bring you in their life, okay? So some of them have their mother approving them of you, okay? So maybe there is an older figure who approves them to be with you, okay? If not, if the mother is not involved, then I feel that this person does see you as, in both the cases, yes. There is a strong validation for marriage proposal. So yeah, this person sees you as the, your a future partner and they see you as a perfect marriage material all right scorpio please i'll take these cards up again 
page of pericles i feel that this person is uh, finding it difficult to express emotions because they've never done that before and so that is why it's very difficult game for them to express how they feel so they're taking it too too slow to actually express what they're coming for okay so you have to wait if you're interested for them for them to open up if they are giving you attention and if they are not being good to you then you know based on your logic you need to move on Okay, so this may or may not resonate with each one of you, but for most of you it will. So I feel that uh, maybe you guys are friends right now and this person might be younger. Okay, strong Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer or Virgo, Taurus, uh, Capricorn for some. Yeah, I feel that they want to, you know, start off again with you as a friend and then slowly turn into a relationship and marriage thereafter. So I feel that... Uh, this person also is having someone else at the background, but they chose you, all right? So that is why they're finding it difficult to completely come towards you and express you exactly what's going on in their heart. They do have someone wanting them, but they want you, okay? And uh, also see that this person is your friend or was your friend in the past and now they want something more. All right, so I also feel that you're having all your cups filled scorpion and they're watching that and they're admiring that people are you you might be doing something that is getting more people attention and they're watching that okay so they feel that they might get rejected by you because you have so many options that later on it's not them i feel that it's you they sense that you have so many options that you might reject them so that is why they're being very very slow okay so they're scared of rejection four of cups this person is definitely a friend in the past. Or you made them a friend now. You friend zoned them. Because you have options, a lot of options. But this person has a lot of love for you, okay? If they are good to you, just because some of you mentioned in the comment section, no, this is not my reading because this person was not good to me. This is wrong. No, it is not a personal reading. And yes, for some of you, if the person is not good with you, it's a simple logic that you need to move on, okay? And life never ends. So you cannot just stop expecting because life is never ending and you need to move. You need to move forward. You don't, you cannot stop. You cannot stop expecting. You cannot stop wanting your life to be full of love in future, okay? Yeah, Scorpio. Whoa. All right, so Ten of Cups. So very clearly, this person is ultimately going to get you by hook or by crook, but not by crook, but actually by hook. So you're getting married very soon, Scorpio. Finally, I feel that this person is going to get you back into their control if they are a good person, if they're a positive person. I feel that in the beginning, you might reject them for a few days and for a few weeks maybe, but they're still keep that positivity alive okay and this will turn into a very fruitful relationship maybe marriage so all your cups will be filled you will have a new home a happy home okay some of you over here i don't know why i wanted to say you you'll turn into a housewife for some of you that's a very selected message okay very happy home all right i don't know why i feel housewife is a better job than a particular job you know doing things for your own house is much more exciting than you know helping another person's business grow yeah so i feel that this person is uh, very dedicated towards you okay and uh, they're pretty sure and they're gonna definitely in a month or so they're coming towards you okay right now they're slow but they'll actually start a new beginning with you in a month or in a year. So you guys will get married by 2021, okay, 2021, or in a month, if that's ha uh, supposed to be early, okay, if you're already dealing with this. All right, so please tell me what other cards do we have for my scorpions the rest of the August. This person is actually imagine, imagining you in their dreams and thinking about this or that. I mean, 
they might be thinking about how you guys are talking or communicating with each other daydreaming a lot especially at night they think about you you know uh, how they would spend time with you or how beautiful you look and stuff like that and uh, yeah they think about you a lot they want to reconcile with you there's a strong reconciliation message that i get so they think about a happy home a family with you now in the end it's totally up to you if you want to allow this person to marry you or not so ultimately this person wants to marry you okay scorpio could be dealing with a cancer as well pay attention to the red flags so there are some red flags with this person i told you there's a good side to this person and then there is a bad side i don't know what that bad side is maybe they are a badly alcoholic person that might affect your personal life maybe they are codependent upon certain things which you don't like and maybe they're too possessive i don't know something is not on the right place maybe it is very mild maybe something to be taken considered uh taken into consideration but i feel that whatever it is you're definitely going to meet a soulmate i know there are so many people who want to marry you scorpio but this is the energy that i'm getting for the rest of the month who wants to marry you but that totally depends upon you if you want to marry this person or someone else but whatever it is it's very clear that you're going to marry your soulmate most of you okay scorpio you deserve love. So somewhere if you feel you're unloved, you need to back off from that relationship and go towards something that is going to give you love and they understand that you're loving. Yeah, you need to free yourself from, I feel, this situation because there is something red flag in this relationship. Maybe in this. Okay, so there are two messages so that you don't get confused and my comment section is still saved. I... I'm getting that some of you might have got out from a very unhealthy relationship and this is a new relationship that you might get into and this is someone from the past okay some of you might happen to see someone from the past with whom your relationship was bad but they are coming back with a new energy okay Either you take them if they have improved or you move on towards your soulmate. That totally depends upon you. So there are two messages and you have to see which one you resonate more with. If you've had a bad past, then there is a high chance that you need to leave it. And this person does want to marry you, but no, it's not going to work and you can find your soulmate next. And if this relationship is new untouched okay this is someone although from the past but the relationship was uh didn't continue beyond friendship then this friendship is going to turn into love okay and you need to free yourself from the past relationship that was not healthy so it's a bit you know can't everything can't be explained clearly so you use your intuition okay Use your intuition in this. Scorpio. So ultimately, you're going to meet your true love soon. So if it's a toxic relationship, free yourself. It, if it's a healthy relationship, go for it. This is the soulmate. This is a true love. Okay. So Scorpio. What else do we get? What I sense from this energy is that I feel that there is someone that's bothering you that you need to free yourself from. Okay? Someone else, not this. No place like home. So someone wants to marry you. Okay, it's very clear. Most of you are just enjoying the time at home simply. Okay. See more. Oops. Okay. 
artist some of you are artists over here or this person is okay so this is the message for you so hope you guys have liked this reading and if you did don't forget to like subscribe share this video and hit the bell icon also mention in the comment section if this if this resonated bye bye